Everybody, my name is Antwoman, and welcome back to Let's Play Civilization 5, episode 5, I think? As Brazil, last time we were at war with the Ethiopians, and we did take Harar, and we're burning it down. It was at 6, it was at 10 when we captured it, and now it is at 4, and now we're just going to try to take Addis Abba, and then completely clear off the island. I don't really remember why I declared war on Ethiopia. I think it's just because they were mad at me, and I gave them back their capital, so... I got to try to have a nice simple trade agreement and they're like, no, we don't want that. <coughs> that was a lot more damage to Mongoose Command than I would have thought. Unit promotion, okay. I got more Musk Command coming, right? One. I thought I had two. Or maybe I don't. I thought I had two Musk Command. Or, or three, I meant. I thought, like, two coming down. Apparently that is not the case. So let's just use our... Who can we attack on? Warriors? Oh, dear. They almost killed me. So let's move them... Okay, we'll move these guys into Harar. Because I need them to heal a bit. Then you could just take out that galley. Promote a unit. Uh, let's just heal instantly. And can we just destroy anybody? We can probably crush these crossbow men. Huh. I don't want to get too close to the city. I'll go, you know, I'm going to take out the composite bowmen. Or I can. I can't. Get, ah. Okay. We'll just move these guys forward then. Then we'll next turn, next turn it. Don't do anything stupid. Well, I mean, by being at war with me, they've already kind of done something stupid, but, you know. Like, if they just want to give up and give me, like, Eddie Saba, like, I'd be completely fine with that. Uh... Let us take out... I don't know. They can basically crush the crossbow, man. Not kill them, but they are basically dead already. And then we can probably get... Can this guy hit one of those guys? He can't. How much damage did he do? 23. How much will this guy do? Enough. I don't think it's just enough so he won't really die next turn. Then that's... There we go. Because that's fine. So I don't think he'll be... Yeah, he won't be killed, right? Okay. And then the Gallius. Really, I can't do anything with the Gallius. I can't go over here. I can't capture Barbarian Camp. But I'll just shoot at them, because why not? And the next turn. Why is it scrolling? Oh, I guess because my mouse is over there. Bleh. Okay. Let me see. What can I do? It's not my turn. It's a city state turn. So Dublin can just fire and probably kill these guys off, right? Yeah. They're dead. And we can fire on those missionaries. I don't want their filthy heretic religion in here. Well, they've already took Dublin with their stupid religion, so that sucks. And Tarar is going to be gone in the turn, so... Hmm. Let me see. We can do that. Probably kill these guys off and crush the swordsmen. And they're not close enough to the city. And we'll maybe pull these guys back. And then they'll heal. Uh, and then, probably bonus against land units because I haven't really... There's no, there's no navy over here. And again, it's both basically useless to me. It's never going to be really used for anything. All I can do is probably set it over here fighting to try to scout. Bleh. Okay. What am I building here? Globe Theater. Okay. And that's what again. Great writer's been more. Nice. Uh, great profits also been more. But what is this? Two writer slots. Okay. So we burn down that city. It'd be... Like, I kind of want to get a city because there's a lot of resources over here. Wine and whatnot. They have musket men? They just Well, they're not allowed to have muskets. I, mean, I don't know how barbarians got a hold of muskets, but they're just they're not allowed to use them. Then a great prophet, spread religion. But I don't I haven't enhanced it yet, haven't have I? Have I enhanced the religion? Can I just is there a religion screen? Religion overview. Oh, I guess I did. I don't remember when I did that. But apparently I did. 
So, really, is all you can do is spread the religion? Is there nothing else you can do? If that's all you can do, then I'm just going to send them over here and try to spread the religion to all the city-states. Consume great work. Probably get our tourism up to ten, right? When scholars yeah. study a thing, they strive to kill it first. If it's alive, then they have the parts, and they'll be lost the whole for the link. Okay. Uh, combat strength. Really, I'm just going to heal these guys, and then probably guard them next turn. I guess these guys aren't even friendly territory anymore, so they're going to heal slower. So that kind of sucks. Maybe I should have left that city alive just at one, like, health. That might have been good, but it's too late now. The city's burned at everyone, and it's dead, so... We're out. Chemistry. Oh! Okay, I'm going to pull back, and then get these guys to become cannons. And then we could finally start the uh, invasion of the final city. I don't know how strong it is. It's only 18. I took the city over here that was like 23 with trebuchets. So I don't need cannons, but I'm definitely going to take cannons. What do I want? Arsenal culture. Defensibility in all cities are 25% more effective. That's pretty good, in case we ever get invaded. And then additional trade routes, sure. I don't even have all my trade routes yet. How am I so bad at this? Instruct the holy site. That is what, six strikes of faith? I don't really care. Like, as long as this island is my religion, I don't really care at the moment. Like, I'll just save up all of my religion. All my religious points, just in case foreign evil religions come and try to take it over. But, I'm probably not gonna do anything else in terms of religion. So you go there, and then 95 gold, sure, I have, 20, I have like two grand, so I can easily afford that. Now we just get more cargo ships, and they're almost dead. Adopt the policy, something probably in rationalism. Yeah, one gold for every science building. Ah, eh, sure, why not? Money's always good. What's after that? Oh, that kind of sucks. Cause I probably I need people to find to have research agreements with. That's really good. 17% extra from universities? Wow. That is quite lovely. And then, yeah, okay. So I'd probably bring it up to 12 then. Gatsby believed. And then he wrote, what did he write? Did he write the word Gatsby? I think so. It would make sense because he said something about Gatsby. It's a good book, by the way. You should read it. Um, I basically already took Ethiopian culture, but. And they've, yeah, they've done nothing to me. They're not even known culturally in my civilization. Like, ew. Bre Ethiopia? More like Nothiopia. Oh. Well, they both did not exist, so I guess it kind of makes sense. I need to find those other cities at some point. Like, I do have the printing press, so I can probably f start the world, uh, whatever. World Council. I think it about it, I, I probably won't. If any of the other civs have the world or have the printing press I'm not going to be able to use it or not be able to found it because they probably would have already discovered all the other three sieves unless they're all on three random islands which I highly doubt okay, I just need to get rid of that guy so he doesn't destroy my trade route okay cargo ship okay you need to order great profit spread that religion and then he's going to come down to Florence and spread it there as well. Because they give me two extra gold for every city, right? No, this is this is a terrible deal. Refuse. It's god awful. You don't know how to handle negotiations at these Abba. Or that's not his name. His name's ha Heil. I'm not even going to try. But, you know. He doesn't know what's good for him. What am I doing? Choose production. Uh, I don't need more soldiers right now. I should probably... No, I, I'm not going to get more boats because I need to get uh, astronomy, I think it was, to try to get a navy that can go overseas so I can defend my borders that way. But I don't need to, you know, build those other ships because they're kind of useless to me because they can only go on, like, sea tiles. And those kind of are garbage. Coliseum? I don't need Coliseum. Like, I might be unhappy, but I'm not terribly unhappy. So, I'll just defend, I'll get walls. Have our troops move forward. I guess we'll finally kill this guy off. 
Establish a trade. Establish a trade route or don't. Fine. See if I care. Unless this is the stupid animation, yeah. Okay. Six gold. I don't need gold. I, you know what? I'll get extra production in Edinburgh. Where's Edinburgh? He has to go all the way around. Wow. Okay. And then we'll move our cannon forward. You are done in your job there. So let us go down into Florence. You know, I don't even need you to heal, really. I don't really need any of you heal, to be honest, but... Because this is definitely enough to take out that city. I don't even need the cannons to take out this city. But, you know. Like, look at like look at these cities. Florence is at 41. Oh, it was at 41. But all these 48 in Jerusalem. That is a lot of defense. I don't understand why this... Stop scrolling. I don't understand why the city-states always seem to have more defense than any of the civilizations until, like, very late game. Probably because I suck and uh, all the other civilizations suck, but... Caravel. Fast... No, it's the, what's after astronomy then? It's what's after astronomy then. Navigation, yeah. So that gives us our naval, like, army. Let's see, architecture. A lot of culture buildings. Taj Mahal. Yeah, architecture is a lot of culture, so I'm gonna get that. Like I said, I, I'm trying to go for that cultural victory. So I don't know how to improve tourism, though. That's the one thing I don't know how to do. Is the tourism, all that. Like, I'm, I'm getting pretty popular in Ethiopia, but it doesn't matter, because once, like I said, they're not going to exist in, like, very soon. Just take that guy out. He needs orders. You come marching down. You go there. And then you can probably just go right there. Okay, and then, you what, you're just going to shoot them? My guys are still shooting rocks. That's kind of pathetic. Like, we have cannons and you're shooting rocks. So what is the AI? What, what unit is the AI going to bomb? The cannons? Wow, they didn't even take out a cannon. The archers might. Yeah, there you go. But that's only half health. So, you know. Like, Adi Saba, he's, he's, it's becoming mine. There's no way it's not. Come on, barbarians. I don't even know where you still are. I guess you're still on that island, but, you know. Hundred and eighteen damage from one cannon. Wow. Like I probably didn't even need those two cannons. Bazario can Xavier Natari the Gita Chunas Tausan. It has a satan for the name of a yen, the gig to must lie like you. And then I guess I'll puppet it for now. I don't want to annex it. So then We'll just alert all our tr troops, get our galleys. You know, I'm gonna go scouting with him, because I have nothing better to do. So does Orthodox... I guess this is still... I guess I need to probably get rid of this evil Orthodox and get our vastly superior zoology or whatever. I think this is probably... Kind of, this is probably offensive to a lot of people be calling it that, but you know. So then I just no, I guess I'll wait for the city states to be done there. I guess done everyone done their turn. I just got iron. Where did I get iron from? Iron connected from Sarka. How come they're friends with me now? What have I done? I've done something. I don't really need to be called over, over two more. There's only three civs left in the game. Yeah, there's only three. And I'm the worst in approval. But I'm first in Basically everything that matters. Literacy being like the first thing. Uh, what am I doing? Musket man? You can just go- How about these guys are just gonna go fall back into my cities just to go defend them, because why not? Yeah, and then you're gonna keep exploring. Explore the great my DC and see if I can get off here without having to, um go over ocean tiles. That might be important. Like, we're already at the south. Yeah, like, and look how big the world is. Yeah, it's just, the world's pretty tiny. Like, I'm, like, apparently, like, right dabs smack in the middle of it. So, you know. Great, ours has been born. Excellent. 
you can go to Edinburgh, you can go to Cardiff, and you can go to Dublin. And you can't do anything, excellent. Why can he not do anything? Probably because I don't have any artist slots left. What's this? Sistine Chapel. What is, is that art? Like, it looks like great work of art. Yeah, two turns. So you just do nothing this turn. You could do something the turn after. I don't know how, long, how many times he can do this. Like, that might have consumed him. No, he still got one more, so we could probably convert this holy city. So that religion's basically wiped off the map. Like, I've already basically took, taken out Christianity. That was, that was Christianity, right? A Catholicism, no. Okay. What do I want? Castle for extra defense. Uh, the bank. I, like, I already got a lot of gold. And the least of production here is no longer two. Opera house, cultures... Coliseum, like, why are people so mad at me, for one? Population, number of cities. I guess it kind of all makes sense. Like, in all honesty, we should maybe have more workers. Like, what are my workers doing? Are they building for... What? No. Stop that. Fine, you build a castle. Oh, wait. I, I thought I told you to build a castle. You build a univers... Why do you not have a university? You get that done. Uh, nine extra production in this city. What's this production? 50? Having it up, increasing it by, like, what? 20%? Yeah, that seems like a good... A good deal. You do that. Then there's a galley over here. That's excellent. So basically, we're trading production between these two. Like, we have, like, two cargo ships going back and forth that are trading production. Which is fine. Well, I didn't even need to take out that galley, because apparently Jerusalem just did it for me. And then you can come over here and you can get rid of that religion. And then one more turn for you. Can you go? Oh, you can go up. Is there anything up? Yeah, no, it doesn't look like it. So you might have to go this way. It'd be, it'd be kind of funny if we were actually on the same island, like just Sarma kind or whatever, just kind of linked it to. But I'm, su I'm sure that one civilization would have sent a boat at some point. So I kind of, I, I highly doubt that is the case. Oh, next turn. I probably should turn on the auto end turn, because that probably would have been very useful. But we're in the 1700s. How many years does it go by now, every turn? Is it 5 or is it 10? Because I can't imagine it being more than that. Okay, it's 5. I'm so we got that Sistine Chapel. We'll just defend with our artillery. You create a great work of art. The blue boy, okay. You don't even need to be down there, so we'll, we'll send you down. Because we need to get that guy to go scouting. The porcelain tower, Taj Mahal, culture, more art or artifact. Mil Why is the military advisor recommended, though? That's the weird part. I'm going to go with the Taj Mahal. And then for you, I guess we'll go with the storm because that's what they want. And like I said, I need to get my navy up a little bit, so, you know. Being able to fend against evil embarked armies. We're trespassing in Jerusalem. I'm sorry, but I need to get by. There's nothing I can do about it. Dublin converted to Orthodox. Oh dear. Oh dear. Come on, you guys get over there. We need to get rid of this Orthodox holy city. I can't, I, I probably put myself in a bad position because I basically have nobody to trade with now because I did wipe out everyone on my island, but cities we like to visit the most. I got uh, four of the top six, well, four of the only six, apparently. So, you know, that's quite excellent. I'm doing good for myself in that front. So I'm definitely winning the whole tourism thing. So what cities are making it? Cardiff, Dublin, Edinburgh's got... Oh, I have a lot of writing slots, but I'm not getting a lot of writers. Uh, how, how many points? 10 for writers, 12 for artists, 8 for scientists. So I'm doing fine kind of there. And then all the, the, you know, special guys are working and all of that. 
I would rather have two guys on university. Wait. No, no. Okay, just don't do that. So I'm bad at apparently managing these. Cardiff. You don't go to annex you. And then. Just probably. What's production? 12? How how much is Coliseum? 60. You know, I'm just gonna buy it because I don't have the time for that. Just so I can get a little bit more control over my empire. So I can build more things, get the buildings I need that, and I want. And eventually probably build military units there as well if that ever is required. So let's go up to, let's go up to Dublin and take out that religion. Because I think if no city has any orthodox followers, then orthodox can't spread anymore. Like, that makes sense. But then again, all of my cities have orthodox followers in it, uh, in them. Which kind of sucks. It's kind of garbage. And no, there's nowhere on this island I can't, I can't leave. Unless, uh, maybe over here? I don't know, it's kind of a stretch though. The Porcelain Tower? You got only 12. Is there anything I can do to increase? You don't even have, you don't even have a university yet, guy. Come on. Come on. And then, um, can I, how much are the, uh, 440 gold? Sure. It's probably just a, I'm probably just throwing money down the drain, but I kind of want to go find everyone else. Just maybe get a little bit more trade in. You know, because I probably have a ton of extra resources. Like, I have a ton of salt, ton of, like, silk. I have, like, 17 things of silk that I can go trade. But I can't. Because, um, I have no one to trade them with. There was that sneeze from last time that didn't come. Okay. So there's only three players left, right? Like, one guy got wiped out super early. I wiped out the two people on my island. Yeah, so there is only three, but I'm not the worst in anything. I'm the best in a few things. Like, I... Like, who's the worst? That's the question I want to know. Is who is doing the worst? I'm just gonna have you build your academy. That actually gives me extra food too, so that's quite nice. I'm gonna send. I'm gonna try to send the caravel back over here because like there's there's like barbarians and whatnot over here, but there's nothing bad over on this side. So, great science is 24 percent faster. I just want this free thought. That's what I want the most because that sounds it sounds excellent and I want it. 14-ish turns. Probably actually not. Probably like 12 maybe. Yeah, 12. Using grass on Sarmakite. Oh no. But really, until the the uh, world or the global, you know, thing. You know, the global thing. Oh, but Antwerp. They're kind of exploring. Where are they? They're over there. They're on that island. But until the global conference is founded, the World Congress, I don't need to actually even be friends with any of these guys, because they're not going to be any, benefic any benefit to me. But I do have four, I think each one gives me one extra vote, so that's four extra votes if I make them all friendly with me. Like, do they have to be friendly? No, like, they have to be allies, not friendly. they got to be more than friends. Uh, we're going to make Jerusalem a bit more mad at me, because, you know, that's just kind of how I do things around here. Anyway, finish the Taj Mahal. We can do that, because it gives me a lot of extra culture. Uh, great musician, sure. Edinburgh can be useful. I know it's not prevent pronounced Edinburgh, by the way, but I'm going to keep pronouncing Edinburgh. I think it's like Edinburgh or something, but it, that's not how it's spelled, so I'm not going to pronounce it that way. Because I am ignorant. The wind. There we go, we got our navigation. I don't want to go... Ex uh, I don't really want to go out because I know bad things are going to happen because of barbarians that are over there. So that kind of sucks. I don't. Oh, sweet! We found a natural wonder. Well, if if I can get somehow get a city around near this island or next to that volcano, I'll be getting an extra five science, which is nice. Archaeology, archaeological dig. And this is once again another cultural upgrade. So I am definitely going to do that. 
So once we hit about turn 200, I'm probably going to end this episode. It probably, it feels like it's probably going to be a longer one than normal. But that is completely fine. Just having it as a nice 200 even-ish number. And there we go. We found another civilization. Gallius, come on. Have we found them yet? I guess we're not close enough to have found them, but... Let's end our next... Let's end our turn. Who is that? I want to say it's the Aztecs, but I'm not 100% sure. Who are you? Like, I think it's Aztecs. I think Aztecs like the teal and red. Hey, hey, don't scroll like that. Yeah, it was the Aztecs. That is... Yeah, hello. Anyway, do you have anything I don't have? You have silver. I don't know who people are cheering about. So is World Congress not... No, it hasn't actually even started yet. Do they not have printing press? 136. I'm dominating in technology, at least compared to... The Aztecs. I found Bibelos, too. Bibelos. Let me see here. Demographics. Okay, the Aztecs are the people who basically suck. But they're second in technology. And they're the most approved. And they're the biggest army. But then again, like, I, like they're on another island. Why is there such a huge evil navy near me? And they destroyed a bunch of my trade routes. Wow. These are jerks. Look up, there's so many barbarians. There's way too many of them. So let's just, I mean, you know, I'm going to go, I'm going to skip all this. Let's just get some caravans. Because they're not going to be destroyed by barbarians. Even though I'm pretty sure they don't give me natural wonder. Nice. I'm pretty sure um, th there's no barbarians on the island as far as I know. So I'm not going to be really too worried about that. Except I'm she... Yeah, I guess. I have no reason not to. So that's your capital. Uh, I'm not going to try to pronounce that. Techno. Ten Ochitalian. That's, that's not it at all. But it doesn't matter. But it seems as if he's the second most advanced civilization, right? Because I think he's second because he's not last. Makes sense. I can, do, you know, math and all that. So it makes sense. So I'm definitely going to start the World Congress because apparently the other civilizations are complete idiots. There's Geneva. Okay. Ah, dropped. Why am I holding two water bottle caps in my hand? Okay. That's just a bit weird. 1810. Decoration from Spain. Oh, okay, we've met Spain now. Dios bendiga a aquellos do you que have anything merecen. I don't have? Soy oh, you Isabel do. De España. Gold Continua. and silk. Espero what is que this? Este this is just a bad deal. Except no embassy. How is it not a failed fair no deal? Okay, Dios. go back. 5-2, you have extras. Espero que este trato reciba su bendición. Do you not know how extras work? The extras is that they're free to give away. That's basically how it works, game. No. Uh... Espero que este trato reciba su bendición. So the World Congress has been founded, right? There's only two other civs, though. As far as I know, there's only two. Yeah. Unit promotion. Yeah, okay, this era. Jesus kids. Cool. Where is Brabard C units? Make a proposal. I'm gonna to completely click the propose. And bar I'm gonna embargo Spain. Yeah, screw you, Spain. That's what you get for being a complete jerk to me. You get embargoed. How many points do I have? Two. And they all have one. Okay. Because it's just the beginning, so... Nobody gets any bonuses. In terms of world culture. Like, the Aztecs are fine. I'm fine with the Aztecs. So they hate the Spanish, too. So, you know, that's good. Spain basically doesn't deserve to exist, as far as I'm concerned. Because, you know, they've made outrageous demands. So do you not see what happened in Ethiopia? 
they made the man's difficult and they are no longer existing in the world. So, you know, think about that for a sec. Okay, five food production. Like, I don't really need money, I'm just gonna, you know, try to get all production and whatnot up. You know what? What do you recommend? Opera House Extra Culture? Oxford University definitely sounds wonderful to me. Uh, you can get archaeologist. Is there any archaeological sites? Like, I don't even know what they look like because I've never really gone into the whole archaeology part of the game yet. Museum. Extra culture, sure. Choose research. Tallgary, economics, fertilizer. What do any of these lead to? Fertilizer leads to dynamite. Multigrade leads to military service, which then leads to dynamite. Economics leads to industrialization and rifling. Or does we need even tall grade to get rifling too? Yeah. Hmm. Scientific theory, which I need economics. Let's get that because then we can get public schools. Get our science even greater than what is that? What it, than what it was at before? Yeah. Okay. And we're definitely rising. They're rising with me, Spain, Brazil. What's my culture? Seven hundred and seven thousand. Wow, that's a lot better than what they got. Take a look at that. Three thousand. Three thousand. So my culture basically destroys theirs. Like there's almost no competition. Seven, seven, six. Like I have no one really to trade to. I'll just trade. Get ten extra production in Rio de Janeiro from these two cities. I'm gonna even get more. We get even more culture from this guy. We made a lovely picture of IS. I think it's just any war, but I'm gonna. I, yeah, it's definitely just any war. But I kind of feel like it's the American Civil War. But I, I got no uh, proof of this. This looks like it takes 19 turns for or 20 turns for this to happen. No, politics is the best way to make sure you don't get anything, Spain. Like, I, I'm completely against you now. And then, once the next proposal, actually, next, hey, great merchant. Propose two, and then one for per city state ally. Okay. Three, three. Enact host. I'm gonna, me, I'm gonna be the host. Three. And then, even if they vote for themselves, we'll be tied, and I'm the current ruler, so I assume that it's going to be me. And then Spain's trying to ban Silk, and that's that's probably like the thing I have, right? Let me see, like, yeah, Saludos. trade Silk, then them trade. Unless we're already trading Silk, I don't know what we actually have. Uh, diplomatic overview. We are trading deal history. Aztecs. Yeah, okay. Yeah, so I'm the only person who has silk, and that's probably why she's trying to do that, because she's a jerk face. There we go. Got like an extra of 20 ish of science there. I wonder if there's a way I can get the Aztecs to play war on the Spanish. The Aztecs are just garbage. Like, I probably wouldn't be this far ahead if I didn't take over everyone else. And it kind of don't like how the animation doesn't play out. If I'm not actually looking at it. What would it take for you to declare war on the Spanish? Oh, wait, you're already at war with the Spanish. Okay, excellent. Excellente. Excellente. So what do my advisors have to say on the situation? Spanish Empire doesn't have a strong military. The Aztecs are about the same. And we have additional gold we can do. Settles. Or new continents. We are making money. Thank you. Culture. Hidden sites. Okay, let me just look at this. Uh, resource icons. Is it resource? Yeah, they're antiquity site. Antiquity. Anti There's a lot of sites on this island. There's four I can see. Yeah, one, two, three, four. One, two, three. And then there's four here. Any more? There's one up there, but I think the barbarians. And then there's probably some over here, which I cannot see. That's crabs. That's completely different. Okay. 
So I'm gonna get those. Cargo ship, you can establish trade route. Anyone better than Jerusalem? No, okay. But right now, can I just purchase archaeologists? How much do they cost? Apparently, I cannot just purchase archaeologists. Okay. Conduct a trade mission with... Who's someone who I can... We'll call Jerusalem, because why not? Because I really don't need extra money. Like, right now, I'm making a pretty good amount. So I'm just going to try to establish some trade routes to get a little bit of friends. Yeah, I'm still the host. Okay. You know what? I'm going to give you a gift. How much influence does it take? 60. Hmm. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to spend 3,000 gold here. But I think it's going to be worth it in the long run. I don't need to give these guys. Then Florence. There we go, 3,000, and now I'm allies with everyone, so they should have an impressive- Yeah, an impressive seven votes. Basically, I get whatever I want. That's basically what how it is right now. So, unless they get more allies, it's basically a Brazil world. The world is in- the world is my oyster, basically. Oh, Oxford University finished at the same time economics is done. That is... That's actually wonderful! 16 wonders compared to their four. They don't even have- they have half of what I have combined. That is just crazy. Get a free tech, industrialization... What do I want? That's extra production. I like science. Three plus science already, plus one for every two citizens. So that's like 10, that's like 13 extra science from that city. So I'm gonna go... Ah, I don't... We go free scientific theory. Get a public school here. Get a public school there. Oh, then we can go with like, electricity? Aluminum. Police station. Oil. I think we're gonna go with industrialization, just get extra production in all my cities once I'm able to get factories. And then I can also adapt an ideology once I get three as well, so that is definitely what I'm going to be going for. So their island's like just right there basically, so it's not even that far. Yeah, look how far it is. Why don't we accept embassies? I guess because um, we're part of the World Congress, I instantly get to know where they are. 36 turns, wow. It's kind of garbage. Unless it's less now because I freed the area or got rid of the barbarians, I don't know. I can't do anything there. Six, seven, seven. Yeah, we'll do that. Then, yeah, uh, can. That's after almost 500 gold, so we'll do that. There we go, got a bit more. A bit more respect from Jerusalem. I don't know what people from Jerusalem are called, so I'm not gonna attempt to say anything about that. But once I get these public schools up, I am probably going to get some archaeologists to get those four sites around my country. Because that is definitely going to be useful for me. Colombo. We're the first empire. Like, they're right there. And we're the first ones to get them? Wow. That's quite pathetic. It's both completed the leading tower of Pisa. Ooh, now their wonders combined equals more than half. Give them a nice... Nice little round of applause. And then let's just destroy these archers. Who do you think you are, archers? Come on. Oh, they actually didn't die? Wow. I am quite surprised by that, actually. Colombo has a terrible military. But you, we need archaeologists. We're going to need, what, four, I said? There's an archaeology site right there. Antiquity site, and then there's some outside of the borders So I don't know what those are 
did he, he shot, did he really shoot a single arrow at me? What was that? That guy just had a suicide wish. You, uh, I guess we'll just go explore the seas. There might be more city states, because I think there's 12. I think I did set them to 12, or maybe it's 16. I don't remember. I don't remember the exact number. But I should be able just to explore and find them all. Because I'm pretty sure the rest of them are probably just on tiny little islands, such as, you know, Antwerp was and Colombo. Probably on tiny little islands by themselves. Oh, I lost that one city as a friend? Wow. 120 gold to become a frigate? Yeah, that doesn't seem worth it at all. And there's another city state there, too. Stop the trade route with. Do they still give me the most money? They do. Okay. You give a gift. Why are you no longer my friend? Ninety-six out of sixty. Okay. Metallurgy. I want. I guess metallurgy makes sense. We can get uh, more. I guess rifling and dynamite and fertilizer or whatever else we need. Lahanza is our friend now. Three more turns till the end of this episode. I guess the barbarians are still doing their thing. Well, I guess two because it's probably going to be 198 when I. Yeah, there we go. A great musician has been born. Nice. Create a lovely song. Wasn't what I was expecting. So, uh, yeah. Are we in the industrial era? Yeah, we are. So I don't know what. That's not even a song from this era, so I don't know what he's doing. Like, industrial era, that is. Yeah, that's like the 1800s. That's no, that's not this time period. That was more like a 80s thing. It's probably not an 80s thing at all. I'm just making a random assumption. Next turn. Yeah, because we don't even have like planes or anything. Like that's, that's like not. Yeah, no. Yeah, no. I'm not. Spain. Can I just announce Spain? I don't like Spain. Denounce to Spain to the world. Come on. Barbarians. Gonna end it this turn so that. Uh, you. Saludos. Yeah, denounce. You're not gonna go to war with me. I know you're not. Like. I actually, the worst amount of soldiers? How did, when did that happen? I guess I'm not at war. But seriously? Come on. You're like, just kill those pikemen. Who do they think they are? Like, how do you have, how do you have pikemen and riflemen or whatever else they had and not consider yourself civilized? Like, there's no way you'd have muskets and not be civilized. It just doesn't make any sense. And then, construct an archaeology thing. These guys can only, when they do this, they're, they get consumed, right? I think they do. Even if they don't, it's good to have, like, two going all around. So they, so those two guys, they apparently completely hate each other. I can, I can understand why you'd hate the Spanish. Because the Spanish are jerks. There never was a good knife made of bad steel. Oh, we got another, is he a writer? I think so. It is easy to go down into hell. Night and day, the gates of dark death stand wide. I don't know where that's from. Because I'm uncultured. Uh, come on, choose production. We need to finish this turn. Red Fort? No. Maybe. What's Red Fort do again? Like, Grand Temple? No. Extra defense, extra culture. Sure, archaeologist. Where were those other sites? They're down here, so let's go. You go do that. Adopt the policy. Hmm. 50% range combat strength. I don't know what I want, because none of these seem extremely useful. You know, I'm going to get this, just to get city-states to like me a bit more. Choose research, we will get... Uh, electricity, maybe? Let's see. Okay, I just want to see what's after those. Dynamite, steam power, refrigeration, radio. Radio is a culture thing. And for that, <coughs> I need electricity, so I'm going to get that. And with that, that is going to be the end of this episode. Thanks, everybody, for watching. My name is Vinny. So if you enjoyed, thumbs up. If you didn't, thumbs down. Press subscribe up above. And uh, if you didn't, 
you go watch my other videos or you don't go watch something else I don't know so goodbye